Corporate Communications, Subaru of America, Michael McHale. So good morning everyone, you are very welcome to the Subaru press conference here in Detroit. Thank you very much for coming. You know, uh, as we were getting ready for this show, we were thinking a lot about three-letter acronyms and the, the TLAs that are in our lives. And here are some that are in my life that got me thinking about this show. So, I like the BBC. It's a good three-letter acronym. The EPA I like too. They do good work for us. Uh, the EPL is the English Premier League, one of my things. The NFL was my thing when the Eagles were playing, but not so much now. The IRS I can live without. Uh, the TSA I think is in all of our lives. TBS is in my hotel room. LJ, LKJ, sorry, is a shout out to uh, uh, those of us that read the automotive press from a long time ago. But those are the, the three, the, the TLAs that are in my life. But there's, there's only one TLA that I'd like to talk about today, and that TLA is SDI. So here to tell you all about the all new Subaru. WRX STI, Mr. Tom Dahl. Thank you, Michael. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen, and Happy New Year. 20 years ago, a small group of engineers in our in house performance division, Subaru Technica International, or STI, began work on a series of low volume versions of the impressive WRX. Their aim was to develop a car with even greater power and grip than the already potent WRX. They wanted to deliver an outright performance machine that took full advantage of the WRX's natural abilities in production car circuit racing and stock car racing, and, and push those abilities out even further. In this pursuit, STI created the WRX STI version 1. For version 1, they developed a 250 horsepower turbo boxer engine that featured a much lower torque peak for quickest response. They upgraded the factory uh, WRX suspension system with carbon fire and tower bars and added forged pistons for better brake and better brake heads. And so in August of 2000, 1994, the first WRX STI product was born. By this time, Super Technica International was also making its mark in global motorsport and took three consecutive World Rally Championships in 1995, 1996, and 1997 most famously with the renowned Subaru 555 car piloted by the legendary Colin McRae. At its debut in 1994, the WRX STI version 1 already had the famous big wing in place, but the now familiar wide body STI had to wait until 1998 in the iconic WRX STI 22B. Built to celebrate both McRae's WRC manufacturer title 3B and Subaru's 40th anniversary, the wide-body 22B was powered by a hand-assembled 2.2-liter boxer engine, basically a WRC race car for the street. The original build was just 400 cars and was for the Japan market only, and they sold out in under 30 minutes. Only 24 more were subsequently made for the world market. Here is a car that can compete with performance models costing many times its price. It was well for its sturdy motor its sure-footed symmetrical all-wheel drive and its aggressive looks. Customers in Europe embraced this gutsy upstart that could take on their own hot models and beat them on their own race and rally circuits. So game-changing was the STI that calls for a U.S. debut started to grow loud. And, not blind to what was going on in the gray market, the STI made its North American debut right here in Detroit for the 2004 model year. So for the first time, U.S. customers could legally get their hands on the car. Since its introduction, the STI has spawned fan sites, race clubs, and enthusiasts across the world. In its original DNA, a wide body stance, a gutsy and tough boxer engine, and Subaru's unmatched symmetrical all-wheel drive remain the three pillars of the STI to this day. Its sporting credentials have been furthered by the exploits of world-renowned drivers such as Colin McRae, Heather Solberg, Richard Burns, Ken Block, Travis Pastrana, and our current Rally America champion, David Higgins. In 2011, an SDI driven by David's brother Mark set a new record at the infamous Isle of Man TT bike circuit, averaging over 100 miles per hour on its hair-raising tight and twisty public roads. 
The STI also brought home a win in its class at the Nürburgring 24-hour race in 2011. For two decades, the Subaru STI has been the byword for exhilarating performance. And now, a new chapter in its storied history is about to be written. In recent years, Subaru has upped the bar for what people can expect for handling in a modern school car. For example, the Subaru BRC has wowed media and the public with its direct responsiveness and control. And the 2015 WRX has earned rave reviews for its razor sharp handling and lightning quick responsiveness. And so it's fair to assume, and you can expect the same thing from the STI, and it's going to raise the agility bar even further. In fact, you can be sure of it. Model. Powerful to look at and powerful when driven. Astonishingly agile. And with the latest in interior refinement, the new STI will now take its rightful place as the performance champion in the Subaru lineup. The 2015 WRX STI is powered by a 305 horsepower turbo boxer engine. It comes with a six speed manual gearbox, active torque vector, stiffer shocks, and a stiffened body. A six setting driver control center differential means that you can set the car up to suit your particular driving preference and your mood. It features our SI Drive powertrain control system for intelligent, sharp, or sport sharp response to your input. The new STI will have the best power to weight ratio in its class, sharper steering, and more direct than linear braking through Brembo Super Sport brakes. The all new 2015 WRX STI will drive like nothing else. I promise you. Okay, I've teased you enough. It's time for me to bring it out and show you. Ladies and gentlemen, introducing the all new 2015 WRX S. T.I. Introducing the all-new 2015 Subaru WRX STI. Introducing the all new 2015 Subaru WRX STI.
say STI, that's the image that comes to mind. This limited launch edition of just 1,000 vehicles will go on sale when the car hits the market in April. The limited launch edition is a great historic way to launch the all new 2015. And talking about icons, I do have one more announcement to make. I am very pleased to announce that the illustrious Travis Pastrana will be rejoining the Super Rally team in 2014. We're absolutely thrilled to have our prodigal son, Travis, back in the Subaru family. And you can be sure that he's looking forward to piloting the new STI in Rally America this season, along with our current rally champion, David Higgins, as we look for another winning season in the best kind of racing there is. Ladies and gentlemen, the all-new STI is everything you'd expect it should be. Fast, powerful, and extremely agile. It will again set the bar that pricier cars must try to reach. It will sit at the performance top of our brand, and it will bring more attention and customers to Subaru as we again look to set another sales record in 2014 to top our fifth consecutive sales record of 424,683 vehicles set just 12 days ago. The Demerix STI will hit dealerships in April, and while pricing is not yet finalized, you can expect it to be in line with the current model. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for your attention today, and now I invite you to please come up and take a better look at the new STIs.